Um, Alba does the ePilot, which is a similar product, but there's yeah. um, there's a lot of brands, you know, especially in the past year, I've seen even more and more. There's Claxton, there's um, there's Tri-Rod, there's Uniwheel, there's plenty of products that are out there, but I guess, uh, I don't know what you've got available, but it doesn't really matter. All you've got to decide is what's going to be the lightest weight in terms of uh, how light you need to be to get in the car versus what's going to perform from what you need because you can go a really okay. heavy one that's going to be really really good um but you're probably not going to be able to put it in the back of your car so you got to work out there's going to be some sort of balance as do you fit on this one where you really heavy but good performance but can't put in the car or really light mm -hmm. but can't really go up a hill so i guess you got to decide where you fit on this scale okay and, you, and you've also got to decide i guess how it goes on and off so they all go on and off a bit differently like the bar tech the way you put it onto the chair it just just depends on your function it sounds like you've got pretty okay function where you'd be fine mm -hmm. but each chair mounts onto the thing a bit differently so that's another thing that you want to test each one turns a bit differently so that's another thing you want to test but the best way to do it is just to trial a few of them and then work it out from there okay because i i've i've seen uh, I, let me show you i think you you can see the picture of this thing which is a tree ride with a very right, small yeah. Try ride with a very small engine mm -hmm. uh, wheel. Yeah, uh, I can I cannot find it anymore. <clears throat> so probably I have to go call them directly and ask. Um, which I liked it because it was very small. Maybe it's too small, you know. If if a, if a wheel is like a like a this. Yeah, big, I think know. for those for those really small wheels, they're awesome in terms of portability because you can pick it up with one hand and chuck it into the car. But if you try to go up a hill on that, all the weight. Right, let's just say this is your little device. Mm -hmm. right? oh, yeah. uh, if you go up up a hill, all the weight is on the back wheel, and then this wheel will just spin out like it doesn't get traction. Yeah. 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 So you need a lot of you need more weight. Like if you just have a little tiny wheel, then when you try to go up a hill, it's gonna slip backwards, not forwards. Um, that's my experience. But look, the products change all the time. I've never Use that try ride one. So if you find someone that does it, like don't don't go off my word. You know, like trial it for you, for your environment, for your weight, the way you drive. It's all really individualized to you. But I guess these are just the things you want to think about when you are trialing a product like that. 